Another code kind of tutorial on practice it. This is for exercise 5.8 random walk. So for this one, we're going to be printing out our position as we step forward and backwards. And then when we hit three or negative three, we're going to stop. And then we're going to print out our max position. So we need several variables here. So we're going to start with our position. Um, the second one is our max value. We also need our random objects. And then we need a step integer and a boolean to kind of give us the random forward or backwards value. The first thing we're going to check is that position is greater than or less than 3, and that position is greater than negative 3. So because those are our boundaries for stepping forward and backwards. Um, the next thing we're going to do is print out our position. So we want to print it out like they tell us to. We're going to that position equal to plus our position variable. And then the next step is either stepping forward or backwards. So we want to set pool to a random variable. So random dot next boolean. And then we can use an if loop to set step to either forward or backwards. So let's say it's false. Then step can be 1, else step can be negative. And then we are going to add it to a position. And then we can check if it's greater than our max. So what we can do is set max to math.max of uh, position and max. And this will just check if the position is greater than anything we've ever done before, and just set max to that. Next thing we're going to do is copy and paste our first position, print out the position. So these should be this instead. And then finally we want to print on our max. So there's some print line on max, on max position equal to and plus max. So right here, this code should compile. Um I think there's a little bit of a mistake right here. So what we can just fix up right here is we can just do equals. And that should clear up all the errors right here. And it should compile. As you can see, we have done random walk.